Good morning. This is my Grab a Flyer Model D. It's a revised Model A, of course. It's got the six inch fixed disc on the bottom from standoffs, but it's got these magnets. And I'm gonna tell you the secret right here. Well, we'll see if it's a secret or a, hypo or a hypothesis. Okay, so on the inside edge of these magnets, I don't know if you can see it. It's out of focus. And I'm slipping. See that dot? That dot indicates that is the north side of the magnet and over there is the south side of the magnet. The north side of the magnet is pointing radially inward. South, um, so the magnetic flux density vector is pointing radially inward from infinity, basically through that dot. Of course, the rest of the flux lines are you know, going around it, but the center goes right through that dot radially inward. Then on the top, I have another magnet that is north up, south down. So the north pole of the six radial magnets are going to be attracted to the south pole of the magnet on the top thereby giving me a radial spoked magnetic field. Now the disc is gonna spin this way. Okay. Notice I don't have a bearing on this design. I have a screw that is just barely touching the disc. And so it you know, scrapes as it goes around. So, um, much smaller than the other design. The idea here is, let's say this disc is positively charged. And so it's going to create positive ions in the air around it. The disc is spinning this way, clockwise, counterclockwise. That means the air relative to the disc is moving clockwise. So north to south, or my mag the magnetic field is vector is along my fingers. The velocity vector of the air relative to the magnets is to the left. And so positive charged ions will feel a force downward. They will also be attracted by the negative charge applied to the bottom disc. So all around, everything here is designed to steer the ion downward to create a lift. So we'll be trying this later. Also, I may just be running it from a, uh, where'd it go? From a nine volt battery pack. I got these nine volt battery packs, so I may just run it off that. And that way um, I won't have any issues with arcing blowing out my power supply. But yeah, that's it. Looking forward to the next video. And uh, don't forget to like and subscribe and share these videos with your friends. We still don't have enough subscribers. I mean, we got to get this out to there to, you know, at least a thousand people. So come on, help me out. And uh, this whole thing is being supported by viewers like you. And we have a Patreon and a PayPal. So check it out in the comments below. Have a great weekend. Warp Drive Tech signing out.